My Twitter has never blown up this big. How's it going, guys? Full Metal Master here. We are here with some Sun and Moon leaks. And a trailer is either going to be released tomorrow or the 12th, I believe. It's supposed to be coming out. But we're going to review some of the stuff we have seen so far. Some of the stuff that's come out. And first, the foremost, we're going to go over this Raichu that we have seen. And all these look legit. All these look real. They're all 3D models that look that they're actual leaks so we actually think these are actual things and they have to be and this Raichu has to be with Sage Surfer and oh my goodness I want this Pokemon so bad <laughs> like I've never wanted Raichu any other any other way like this is just it just looks good electric psychic they actually added a typing we have a secondary typing for this electric mouse evolution line that I've been waiting for for so long. It's just, it just looks so cool. I just love it. I love it. I love it. But there was a, I don't know. There was a um thing on Twitter as well. And when it electric terrain is active, apparently it gets a speed boost as well. So that's, that's really nice to see. Also, there were some Coral Coral leaks about this uh, Meowth alone form. And it's a dark type. There was some explanations on it, at least some links in the description below if you want to know more about it. But it has pickup and technician. So you already know I'm going to have a technician dark type version with fake out and dark poles. <laughs> Night slash here I come. But it looks, it, I love the design of this and it looks amazing. Now, before we get into any of the other team stuff, I want to go over all the Pokemon first. We have <sighs> Wishy Wash. Which is the solo form with the ability schooling. Now, I'm kind of sad that this thing doesn't evolve. It's just, there's there's a form. It, there's a solo form and a school form, and apparently it transforms. Or something like that. Some people said it evolves, but then we have... Wish... Washi? The school form of it. But this thing is gigantic. Like, it is huge. And I'll pop up a picture here. I'll pop up a picture. It's it's almost this is an in-game capture of what it looks like. It is big, almost bigger than a Gyarados. And Gyarados is big. Like this is a big Pokemon. This thing is huge. And I love it. I love the design. It looks powerful as heck. For, for starters, but it just Ugh, I love it. I love it, I love it, I love it. Anyway, next up we have Paihuko. It's a, a it's a sea cucumber. <laughs> That's what it is, and it's, its ability is innards out, which sounds disgusting. Other than that, it kind of looks cool. I mean, I don't know what this white thing on the back of it is. It's supposed to be a rabbit cucumber cottontail thing? I don't know. Anyway, where are the other Pokemon? What other Pokemon do we need to go over? Is this the last one? I think this is the last. No, no, no. We have two more. We have two more. We have two more, including after this one. Malor, well, one more after this one. Malor, Malorlo, Grass Fairy. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Malor, Maloriel. I'm not sure, but it has Illuminate and Effect Spore, so it's one of those Grass Fairy things, the mushroom. So it's, I guess, it's gonna kind of be like the opposite of a Moongus Grass Fairy instead of Grass Poison. Kind of looks small. I don't know. It, I feel like it's going to evolve into something a lot bigger and a lot more bulkier, considering its Grass Fairy types. Because most grass fairy types have a good special defense and good um, special attack. So, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. And what I'm really, really excited about, other than the Raichu, is the Marowak, which apparently has been confirmed as well. This isn't a confirmed. This is really one of the ones that we know is an actual thing. This is the one that we know is confirmed. It has Cursed Body and Lightning Rod, and it's a Ghost Fire type, and I love this thing's design. It looks amazing, and I can't wait to see what the Cubone looks like. But so far, wow, voice correct. So far, all we have seen. Oh, here's the electric terrain with the Raichu. I'm gonna add that in from uh, where um that, but it doubles uh, Raichu speed. Anyway, continuing on with the uh, the uh, Marowak and the Gen One. We've only seen uh, Gen One. What is it? What should I call it? A Lolo form so far. So, I don't know if that means we're only going to have Gen 1 little forms. I don't know. Anyway, we have the Team team Skull Simple as well. T 
team skull has to has a bone to pick with you <laughs> apparently and this kind of looks wild i don't know how to feel about it and then we have some of the grunts here as well and you know they kind of look gangs they kind of look like uh, a legitimate gang they don't look like a team they just look like a gang in the alola region to be perfectly honest they kind of look like what 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 was it called in surgeon not like now I can't think of um, what they were called in the Insurgents, but they look like a gang to me. And it kind of looks cool, but at the same time, it's like, how many critics are going to criticize this? Like, I love their I love their sprites. I love their sprites. The guy sprite I like more than the girl sprite. The girl sprite I could see they could improve on, but the the uh, the stances, I'm hoping that's not an actual thing, Nintendo, because... Eh. Anyway, then we have Plume Maria or something. I don't know. A lot of people have been saying they don't like her, like, design for her person. And I don't blame them. She kind of looks... She's too flashy. She's too flashy for me. Her hair shouldn't be pink. It's too flashy. Other than that, her intense stare. You were challenged by Team Skull Admin uh, Plumera. Uh, Team Skull's big sister. She looks like she is out to kill. Like, that stare in her eyes scares me. It strikes fear into your soul. And that's what, I think that's what they're trying to imply. And it looks really good. It looks really, really good. And I love it. I really do love it. And then here, and finally, we also have Gaz Gazma. Gazma, the leader. Fellow rejects... Wait. Fellow rejects... Who never could become captain. I don't know what that means, but this is the big boss of Team Skull. And to be honest, I don't know how to feel. I really don't. He's, he's kind of just here. He's kind of just chilling. But that's all I really have for you guys. This is all that's been released. So hopefully we'll have a trailer on this soon. But this is all I really have. And, uh, well, I hope you guys have enjoyed. And of course, if you have and you're still enjoying the giving you more sun and moon content make sure to slap that like button down below and i will bring more to you as soon as i can bye bye